Okay, so this is going to be our first little install video. Um, we got these EVC iDrive modules, or throttle control modules, from uh, Doug over at Outlaw Off-Road. Yeah, uh, this should only take like five minutes. I think the hardest part is going to be actually fitting myself down there because the uh, little clip I have to get off is actually right above the gas pedal, right up there. Um, I'll try to circle it or something in the video so you guys can actually see what I'm talking about because if I scrunch myself down in there you won't be able to see anything. There. Yes, thank you. So anyways, uh, this should be pretty quick. It's one of those things where everyone should probably have it. Um, it's got a bunch of different modes too. I'll go ahead and link those on the screen. So we're going to unplug what's currently there by sliding out the red tab connect this to the top of the pedal and then the old connector will connect into here. There's the old connector with the little red tab. We're going to be unplugging that by sliding the red tab out. New piece from iDrive, we're going to be connecting this where that old connector was and then the previous old connector will be connecting into here. The new iDrive also has a connector on it which will connect in to this piece on the back and that's what we're going to wire down. Alright, so the red tab is out, pull that up, there you go. So I'm going to go ahead and plug in this bad boy to where the old connector was and lock it in by sliding this down. Alright, kind of have to do that by feel because I don't want to put my head down there. Alright, so that's in place. Lock it in. Push the tab all the way in. It's kind of hard, but it'll go. And then this, sort of like a little extension. This connector here that's just kind of hanging. It's like a little pigtail. The original connector for the throttle down here. It's plugged into this bad boy. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. <laughs> try to do this by feel. So, oh, all right. Just it's like a, it's like a flash drive. You just keep trying it multiple ways. Twelve six. Well, now after that, uh, we've got this little cable coming off of it. Plugs into this bad boy, which connects to our iDrive. I'm gonna route it. Well, so I'm going to situate it up here, I'm going to route the cable down here, and through here, that way it's really out of the way. I think before I route the cable, I'm going to go ahead and stick the module on, so I can just peel this right off. Must be level. Alright, well it's not really going to look centered, but it's centered enough. Put this bad boy in. Okay, now it's time to zip tie it. Little clear zip ties. Alright. And then there's a harness. Well, not a harness, but a cable that's wrapped right here. I think I'm going to zip tie it to that so it'll kind of route underneath the snap that the rug goes on to. If this is long enough. And you can zip tie it really anywhere. My only recommendation would be make sure it's zip tied to something. You don't want this rattling around and when something comes unplugged on the trail, that's the last thing you want. Alright, and I don't feel the need to zip tie that one super tight so yeah stick it down in there attach this back on put the carpet back in place okay 
Make sure that cable is hidden. Don't want your foot catching on that. And there you go.